Hey, what's up? Abdurrahman Hamdan here for Hamdan Films. Uh, sorry, we weren't posting as many videos recently. Uh, that was due to vacation time. I couldn't get my hands on my computer, so I couldn't record tutorials. Uh, so if you if you watched the weekly show, uh, it's cancelled. I'm sorry, but I don't have enough time to do it. So I'll be posting uh, regular tutorials every week or so. Uh, in this tutorial, we're going to be recreating a visual effects scene from Dis District 9, where the mothership, seen here, is floating over the city. So take a look at what we're going to be making. Okay, uh, so now uh, I'll be providing you with two images, a backdrop layer and the ship layer I used drag your backdrop layer to the make new composite and click enter in windows uh, I don't know what you should do on Mac or Linux uh, I don't think there's an After Effects version of Linux uh, click enter and type in BG uh, and drag your ship layer over it uh, right click the ship layer click transform click to comp with then drag it to wherever you want I found this place works best for me uh, so luckily I was able to find two pictures with the same lighting uh, from the backdrop layer the lighting is coming from the right the ship the lighting is also coming from the right so click your background layer go to effect color correction photo filter and select warming filter 81 and this is an awesome plugin it can set the mood of your scene so if, you, if you're on a warm day you can just increase that warm feeling by increasing one of these and you can if you're on a cool day you want the audience to notice you can just increase that and a lot of un awesome stuff there so you can increase the underwater feel of it so in this tutorial we'll just be using the warming filter because we want it to seem uh, Actually, I just found that this works best for me. Uh, okay, maybe a bit lower. 75. Oh, 75, maybe. Okay. Then copy the photo filter plugin. Edit, copy. And paste it on your ship. Edit, paste. But on the ship, decrease it. Set it to possibly. 71 uh, warming filter 81 and uh, for the background check preserve luminosity for the top layer uncheck preserve luminosity or uh, let's uncheck preserve luminosity here too so uh, you can just add a wiggle effect or just save it as it is this looks cool but uh, we want a bit more life added to it so we'll create a new layer uh, I'll ca cancel that no uh, well we'll just stick uh, like this for now uh, so uh, you want to select both these layers go to a layer pre-compose name them whatever you want I'll just name them wiggle and you may notice that we have a new microphone that works better so uh, and if you I'll, I'll be taking tutorial requests now so if you need any tutorial or any help in anything uh, just PM me or post a comment down below uh, uh, click S to show scale set the scale to 110 uh, no, 110 okay um, click P alt click the stopwatch and type in wiggle um, one comma five okay so thanks for watching this tutorial my name is Abdurrahman Hamdan uh, and you well you've just been filled in <laughs> no just kidding uh, so thanks for watching this tutorial uh, post a comment below, like, subscribe, 
you want. Uh, so thanks for watching. I'm Dan Film signing off.